Hello again from the Eurobike show in Friedrichshafen, Germany. I'm John Stevenson from Cycling News and Bike Radar, and I'm incredibly excited to be with six times Tour de France green jersey Eric Zabel, who is now um, in his retirement spokesman for Rudy Project. And uh, Eric's going to be talking to us about the importance of sunglasses um, in professional cycling. Eric, good good day. Hello. Hi. So you've been a Rudy Project rider since 1996. Oh yeah, ever forever. <laughs> But uh, it's true. Since uh, '96, I'm uh, I'm with Rudy, and I'm yeah. Let's say all my 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 career I was uh, with Rudy. So let's take a look at some uh, Rudy Project glasses, and you can tell us about the uh, features that are important to you as somebody who was incredibly fast across the line in those uh, Tour de France stage finishes. Yeah. Uh, first of all, it's. Uh, I mean, it's, uh, it makes sense that the sports glasses uh, uh, protect you from the dust and from the wind. But uh, the latest technology of uh, uh, sports uh, glasses is, uh, is this. Uh, we call it uh, photochrom photochromic uh, uh, lenses. So it means uh, uh, with darker UV light, yeah. also the, the lenses are getting darker. So uh, that's perfect if you go in a forest or in a tunnel. So it's, it's light, and then uh, later if you come out in a completely sun conditions, then it's directly uh, uh, darker in uh, just a few seconds. So uh, this is a UV uh, sunlight simulation. We can, we can uh, put it here, and then in just a few seconds, you can see it's getting darker. And uh, yeah, that's that's perfect. And another thing is, the new lenses are very, very flexible, and uh, they are also very good protected for scratches. So you can go over, and nothing will happen. This is, uh, I think, it's it's very, very good because. This is what the sunglasses have to be, yeah. and uh, what you need uh, in, uh, yeah, in a serious conditions outside. It's also noticeable there how quickly they're going light again. So if you come out of the forest into the sunshine, you're, you're going to be able to see. Um, and if you go into the forest, you're not blind because they're dark. No, that's. Uh, in fact, it's, it needs uh, 15 seconds to change from dark to to lighter or uh, the opposite way. And uh, another thing is uh, with uh, sports sunglasses, it's very important that they fit good on your head because mm -hmm. every head is different. And for that, uh, we have the technology that you can move it in all directions and you can, let's say, find your best uh, position to your head. And uh, the same with the nose pads, and it's also a speci special uh, uh, gum, mm -hmm. that uh, a special rubber that uh, it's uh, protected from the sweat, and it's also very stiff on your head. So very firm, they're going to stay attached no matter what happens. Right. So this is Rudy Project's new aerodynamic helmet. Eric, um, tell us about this helmet. Ah, uh, that's the wingspan. <coughs> it's. Uh, Developed in a wind tunnel with uh, experts uh, by John Cobb, he's uh, <coughs> one of the most famous specialists on uh, uh, aerodynamic uh, wind tunnel testing. And uh, yeah, this uh, <coughs> we found out that this is probably the fastest TT helmet in the world. And we have some uh, some uh, uh, different uh, uh, shapes here, so. The ground shape is always the same, different colors, mm -hmm. but then, this is important, we have here this part. We can put this out for, let's say, Ironman Hawaii. Yep, so for very, very hot conditions hot, or for a long time trial? Long time, 180 kilometers yeah. uh, in very hot conditions, then you have the airflow. And we can put it in, It's let's say for uh, road. Uh, time trials like in a Tour de France and uh, if you you like to use this helmet on the track 
where it's just four kilometers, uh, very fast, and every, every tens of a seconds uh, count. Yep. Then uh, we have a shield, who is uh, what is uh, completely uh, closed, like we have it here in this helmet. Then it's completely closed, and it's that's aerodynamic wise the best. Rudy also has a new um, general purpose road helmet here. Tell us about this one. Very uh, new and fantastic thing is the fit of the, the from this helmet to your head. But then also you can see it here. You can put your sunglasses in an opposite way into the helmet. For let's say a long uh, uphill ride, like a uh, yeah, Paso in the Alps, when your head is sweating. Yeah, and you don't want your glasses misting up and you don't want sweat dripping down the inside of them. Yep. You, you can put it here, it's fixed. It, and uh, all different kinds of Rudy Project uh, sunglasses fit fits into this position. We're also incredibly lucky to be joined by HTC Columbia rider Tony Martin, who's been one of the breakthrough stars of the professional peloton in the last couple of years. Um, Tony, welcome to uh, the Eurobike show. Um, tell us about your relationship with uh, Rudy Project as an up-and-coming young rider. Yeah, I'm riding now uh, Rudy Project classes since a few years, and I'm really happy with that. Uh, the company supports me in every race. Uh, I have always the new stuff, and uh, it's perfect product for me uh, it protects me uh, for the rain for the sun so that's uh, really nice and I'm really lucky with the with the Rudy project have you made any special requests to Rudy for the kind of glasses that you've wanted from them yeah for sure uh, I have special uh, classes for the TT uh, special classes for especially when it's raining uh, so I have the the, the classes that get darker when the sun comes out and uh, get a little more, uh, more uh, clear when the, it starts to rain. So it's really nice. And uh, yeah, so I have uh, for every race situation, I have my uh, special classes. Excellent. It's great to know that they're looking after you so well. Yeah. Um, Tony Martin, thank you very much. Yeah.